Hi there everybody, it's Carolee from CarolieFlatley.com. I decided that today, even though it's probably the, not the best lighting, I would do a video in front of the Christmas tree. Yay! I'm the type of person who puts her Christmas tree up pretty much as soon as possible, uh, as soon as my husband will let me get away with it. So ours was up uh, pretty much on December 1st. Uh, sorry, there's actually corgi spotting in this video. There goes, this is Finny right here with me. Um, so today I thought I would cover um, my most recent shipment from Happy Scrappy, which included her monthly A5 kit, as well as my Happy Dory, which I am totally loving and can't wait to uh, start using more. So I guess it's time for us to head over to my kind of temporary scrapping space and, and cover all the stuff that came through. So I'll see you on the flip side. Bye. I totally have purple hair now. It kind of rocks. Take that back. It rocks a lot. Alrighty. So, um, like I said, this was my most recent package from Happy Scrappy. Uh, I ordered uh, a Happy Dory from her. I had intended to the last time she had sales open and then missed it by like a day. So when she reopened sales, I got on like as soon as possible to get in on that. Uh, this one's mine. I honestly cannot remember which colors I chose, but I can put those in the uh, description for the video if you're curious. Um, usually it just comes with this one piece of plastic in it, but I ordered a couple of inserts. This one has a pocket on the front, and then uh, these ones are just like card size that you could use there. Um, it has a zipper pouch on the back. I've actually been really bad about fully moving into this journal for a couple of reasons I'll get to as I go. Um, the other thing that I ordered was this like graph paper square notebook, which I'm kind of using for bullet journaling right now, which, uh, so I'm working on that. Uh, and then I also ordered just some plain um, just pastel different colored paper. So uh, that's what's going on in there right now. Um, I also printed out the DIY fish inserts for December, um, and I actually scored them already. I'm following a tutorial from, I believe her name's Nadine from the Mixed Plate. I'm sorry if I'm misremembering that, but um, yeah, I can link to her tutorial uh, in the description as well. To, so that you can uh, see what I'm talking about. Uh, so I'm, I've got a December notebook that I'm going to be putting in here to test that out. And I'm sure that when I do, I'll fully move in and start putting, you know, stuff in the pockets and stuff like that. Uh, honestly, I think if you're interested in going to a Midori style notebook, the Happy Dory is awesome. You can't go wrong with it. Um, you do, of course, since each one of them is ha being handmade, there's a little bit of a weight. And it is coming, if you're in the United States like I am, um, it is coming from another country, so there's the the hassles and weights that come along with that, but it's totally worth it. The price is super reasonable, and I really like mine so far. I'm looking forward to taking it with me, when I, obviously, when I'm traveling. I mean, that's kind of the point of it. Um, and I'm really hoping that I like the DIY fish inserts. They're kind of a pain in the butt to put together um, <laughs> because you have to put the whole thing together and then put a kit cover on it, and it's a weird size, and... So it's not as easy as some of the other printables I've used in the past where, you know, you just print them out, cut them in half, and a and, uh, whole bunch of them. But, you know, I think it's worth it because this is super duper cute. And uh, if I can just take this planner with me, um, that would be fantastic. If I could take just this with me instead of, you know, like, here, hold on. I've got my A5, which is gigantic comparatively. Um, <laughs> or... Let's see, I've got my Hobonichi, you know, which is big too, and, and hefty. And so if I just had this one little notebook and this was all that I lost in it, or something happened, uh, I would not shed too many tears. So I'd feel a lot better about taking this little guy with me uh, on trips and such. Excuse my big head. All right, and so then of course, I just like last month got the, um, the uh, planner pack. So, um, let's see what we got. These fell out. These are the little paper clips for this time. We got a tree and a reindeer and like, and two different kinds of bears. They're super cute. I love those. I'm so bad about using, remembering to use them, but they're so adorable. 
I actually really dug this kit because, um, and you'll see why in a little bit when I point it out. There's something really cool in here that I was hoping to, to I was thinking I was going to have to purchase for myself, but now I don't have to. Yay. So as always, you get some washi tape. This one has words and stuff on it. So it says, uh, belongs to, have a wonderful, bonjour, things like that. We got some just notes. These are little notes. They're not sticky notes with animal faces on them. So we got a little pig. I think that's supposed to be a kitty cat. <laughs> Lion and frog. As always, we got two pens. This is another one of those stamp marker stamps and a star. It's a little gray, um, like tip, nib tip pen, which matches our lovely gray weather we're having here in Los Angeles. It's actually why I'm filming over here is because like. This is one of the few places I've got any light right now because it's been raining for like the last week here in LA. Uh, we've got sticky notes as usual. We have, uh, oh, these are so cute. They were stuck to something else. I hadn't seen them. They're just like little cows. That's adorable. Oh, that's super cute. What else? Oh, there's more of them. Okay, this one on the back. Okay, now this makes sense. It's all coming together, you guys. <laughs> So it looks like on the front there's these little tabs, and then inside, a panda, a kitty cat, and then on the back is the cow. Now it all makes sense. It's all coming together. Uh, these are probably more um, sticky notes. Yeah, it looks like sticky notes. All right. We got a little um, elephant clock and apple. These are like little clips, paper clip type things as well, with little faces on the pencils and little corners. One point seal. It looks like we got um, some flowers and some like uh, arctic animals. Cool. Happy day sticker. Stick on talking bubbles. Oh, these are like happy birthday ones. Cool. Yeah, actually my birthday is in January, at the end of January. So I will be using those a lot. We got some animal sticky notes. These are little rabbits. And again, I need to figure out if this is something that I get because it's like there's always one piece that has something to make you happy. I should ask her about that. Little tabs. As always, the A5 size um, dashboard piece. Happy bus mint sticky notes. Yay! So this is like, I recognize these characters, I don't know. It says Happy Virus. I don't know if that's what it's called, but I do recognize them. That's really cute. And then lastly, some like flake stickers. Looks like we've got Statue of Liberty and a couple of other really cute ones. So this was the piece that I was actually really, really excited about. <laughs> it seems like no big deal. Um, but inside, if you'll notice, this has stickers as well as more pages to put more stickers. I've been really needing one of these, so thank you so much, Sam, from Happy Scrappy for including these in our in our kits this month. Um, because I was kind of like, oh, I really need to order one of those. I didn't know where to order it. And so now I have organization for all of my uh, stickers. So I am super duper excited for this. I'm so excited. So, that's really it for today. I think I'm going to keep this one short on the short side, especially with the lighting being so bad. Um, but, um, and maybe I'll check back in next week when I get my, um, my Studio Calico. But I may just do another quick video uh, this week about something, something separate. Um, I was just thinking about it. I was actually talking with someone yesterday about pens because I'm kind of a pen nerd. So I'd love to like cover my favorite pens and all of that kind of stuff. So maybe I'll do something like that this week or next week, um, especially with the holiday. I might do more. I might do less. I'm not 100% sure. Um, and I might also do some uh, some over-the-shoulder type stuff for when I'm doing uh, my December daily, which I need to start very shortly. So cool. I think I'm going to end it there with just this stuff, and I hope you have an awesome week, and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.